Assalamualaikum and hi So today we gonna talk about La Visadal Effect of Lantana Chamara Leaf as right to work Mosquito Lavi Let's check it out Lantana Chamara or also known as Bunga Tahi Ayam was traditionally used for antimicrobial, antifungal, antioxidant and also used for antiseptic so, let's discover the potential of each leaf as right towards mosquito larvae. Let's get to know about the mosquito. Mosquito vector that transmit many fatal disease. Disease such as dengue, malaria, zika and chikungunya. And mosquito have become one of the most herbicidous insect in the world. Synthetic insecticide. We usually use this insecticide because it is easier to buy it at the supermarket. But did you know synthesis insecticide can cause environmental pollution and able to develop the mosquito resistant? So the content of the synthesis insecticide is perotol, organochlorine, organophosphate, and carbamide. So that's why we need another alternative that is more eco-friendly to environment of mosquito control agent. That's why we use plant-based insecticide. Have you ever heard about plant-based insecticide? Now let's get back to our topic on the resident effect of lantana chamara leaf as right towards mosquito larvae. So lantana chamara leaf contain Tritorponite, alkaloid, flavonite, tannins, saponin, and glycoside. Lantana chamara leaf is effective as larvicida and give effect toward mosquito larvae according to specific concentration of the leaf and solvent use. However, the application of the plant-based compound is still limited. Botanical insecticides are only currently responsible for less than 1% of the worldwide pesticide market and there is not much support articles state that on the use of organic larvicida such as lantana chamara in any household to replace synthesis insecticide. That's all from me. Thanks for watching.